Hey everyone, it's Suzanne here and today I'm just going to share with you um, one of the projects I've been doing for Arnavira Scrap and Craft with the September kit and the kit is called See You in the Craft Room. Uh, so in this kit we had beautiful um, Echo Park paper called Under the Sea and I've used some of the 3x4 cutter parts. You'll see them as we go through this. Um, also from the kit I used, you can see here, the very cute little tackle box. I also used um, on these pretty blue fish, I used this beautiful liquid pearls that were in the kit and that's ocean blue that color okay and yeah the color parts so I'll go through it let's start here so in there is a three by four cut apart um, let's make waves the little beach chair I made with some paddle pop sticks um, very tiny ones so they're only about a third of the size of normal paddle pop sticks and I just looked on Pinterest I looked up um, miniature beach scenes or something like that and I found um, uh, you know a little instruction on how to make it. it was really simple the next one I made the little beach sign just um, die cut the letters and just cut the sign out, put it on some string. And I also borrowed some of my daughter's beautiful shells because she has a, a lovely collection of shells that she's picked up over the years. Next is that very, very cute little tackle box there. It's got a blue and white float and some lures so the fish there I'm actually made that out of air dry clay um, the back of it's yeah, pretty bad but the front's not so bad I guess you can tell it's a fish I just coloured it with some Inca gold to make it all shiny I also sewed this bag um, with some I don't know burlap or hashing it's very tight woven I just put a blanket stitch around it and put a handle on so that's the, the fishing bag for the fish and he just goes there next is just a beautiful big bucket of shells and here's another three by four cut apart it says don't be crabby and he's that one's got a cute turtle in and a tiny little shell next one is some netting so it's like a fishing net and there's those two little they're little air dried clay as well but they were done in a mold that I have and again I, I coloured it with the gorgeous um, liquid pearls ocean blue it is beautiful colour and I popped in another one of my daughter's shells next one I made a little picket fence like that you see down the beach um, you know trying to keep people off the dunes trying to protect the dunes and I popped that cute old pelican in there next one is another three by four cut apart in there that says life under the sea was meant to be and another one of my daughter's shells next one some more netting with a cute starfish a sand dollar which is also made from air dry clay and an anchor that I have um, I put 
um, copper embossing powder on it and I also got some sea glass there so the bottom row now is another three by four cut apart that says just keep swimming and some more shells this one has two little bottles one with um, gorgeous just the tiniest little shells another one filled with sand and a cute starfish with some more sand glass and some other brighter um, glass stones and the last one is in the back there you can see it's kind of like a bottle cap embellishment but it's got a seagull standing on a post or something I've got a very old I think that belonged to my grandmother the sailfish ornament and another one of my daughters well I'm not really sure what that is I know it came out of the ocean but that's about all I could tell you about it um and that's it so that's my shadow box so it's got the 12 compartments and there they are all 12 of them have got something in them that remind me of the beach and the ocean which is one of my favorite places to be so I hope you enjoyed having a look Remember, you can get this kit from Aunty Vera's Scrap and Craft. Thank you for having a look. Bye.